Hello everybody. Here I've got very strangely designed three separate channels like MZ16FA microscope. Mm, it has a bit unusual design with two separate stereo channels and one with a little less resolution uh, just for might be alt, uh, fluorescent uh, way of uh, might be filming a photo and I don't know why it's separate technically but it has its own uh, prisms inside special device uh, I have removed those uh, electronically and motor driven parts so now it's controlled with my hand here and we'll try to see what is the alignment of exact this one you can see so far how it's made it's made very very cool here we see three sets of lenses all over the scope the first bottom objectives after that second block of three lenses third and exit one here <clears throat> so let's see how what, what's uh, what's the alignment of the one and we would try to check its resolution a bit you can see a huge lenses here it, it has some issues with the glass so I bought it for very low cost and I will use it for my own needs and you can see a very high quality of making some uh, brass uh, barrels for holding glass very high quality coating the best coating I've ever seen I need to say and mechanically it's just very very sturdy thin here so let's try to find its real alignment because I like uh, overall quality a lot so we have a lowest magnification here and we can check now it's our left channel totally out of focus here's our uh, we could say photo channel uh, much more sharp but still out of focus and here's our right channel still out of focus too so we can see three sets of item of objects on the field let's make uh, uh, magnification a bit higher so in one of positions we can see all three channels went to a snap focus here's our left channel here's our photo channel and here's our right channel <laughs> all three channels are well focused here I would say <clears throat> no errors at all but we could easily see huge misalignment not that good for nice walking let's move farther when I'm making zoom uh, bigger we are moving through some fuzzy point back to another place with focus pretty strange still again left channel again right channel and here's our photo channel so we could even see they are three lined somehow you got a line here okay let's move farther magnification now focus is not get, getting away too much but we still have difference our left channel is a bit out of focus our right channel is is well out of focus and our photo photo channel it just has pretty nice focus here okay let's move farther we are coming to our might be I uh, can say you probe 
I can't say you uh, right magnification here, but I would guess it is kind of um, might be 50 times, but I can't say it for sure. And again, we see left channel is pretty sharp, while right channel here is fuzzy, and our photo channel not that bad, but still fuzzy. So our left is the best here. Let's move farther, and all three channel get to be totally on working. Suppose we, we, we have reached kind of 10 or uh, 100 with 10x eyepieces magnification of whole uh, channels. We can see left channel is totally fuzzy, photo channel is even more fuzzy, fuzzy and right channel is that fuzzy, I just can't see any structures at all. So when we move through through all the range, we can see that values change a lot. I don't know what is the reason for that. Is it somehow fixable? But I need this microscope as my own scene for my experiment. So it would be pity if I wouldn't be able to to get focus sharp over all the range. And by the way, resolution of this microscope is uh, on level of, um, I suppose, like a M uh, 125, and we could say, uh, in compar com comparison with, with known microscopes, it is 30% uh, higher than of Nikon SMZ U and 20% higher, uh, not 20, let's say 15% higher than uh, Nikon SMZ uh, 1000 or Olympus as it X7 to 12. So it's pretty high resolution here and very sturdy mechanical design. So I'll try to to make it working for me. We'll see how it goes. Finally, I'll show you a precise review when it is done. Thank you for watching. Hope you'll uh, you'll come to me next time. Bye bye.